than his. Okay, well, you got you got your boyfriend, Kyle, to, to, to fake it. No, why would I do that? I do, I do, no, Fish. Skylar, I don't want to make things harder why, for you. Why, why are you trying to take away my child? Because she's mine. Well, why would Stacy and Kim say that she's mine if she's not? I don't know. I think that it was Kim's idea. She figured you would keep quiet so that you could have Gigi. Kim. Yeah. Yeah. That girl's capable of just about anything. Move in here, David. Keep an eye on me. There's plenty of money to go around. We can both have everything we want. Unless that dossier goes public. Who's gonna tell? Oh, come on, Kim. I found it. And if a moron like... Wait a second. I played a detective on the Supermodel Crime Club, so I am smart. A moron like a reporter might stumble across it. That would ruin the Buchanan name. B.E. stock would plummet and the money would disappear. So instead, you're going to disappear. Is that the only way to keep you from showing it to Clint? Sorry, JV. You really don't want him to see it, do you? No. Clint's a good guy. He doesn't deserve that. I understand. So go pack your bag, okay? I called a car to take you to the airport. It's not paid for or anything. You'll have to pay for that yourself. Better hurry before Clint comes home and you break his heart. Heart and Bow already did that. He is risen! Get back! God, hold her down. Get He's speaking! You got Judas away from me. What? Judas? I thought that Allison was your best girl. She lied to me about my son. You wanted a strong heir, so I gave you Rex. He was not my son. This can't be. When did Stacy and Kim tell you it was yours? I, ca I caught them. Oh my god, I caught them. Patting Stacy to look more pregnant. I, I figured out that the baby wasn't Rex's and I was going to tell him, and that's. That's when I said the baby was mine, and I. I believed it. I mean, I don't remember sleeping with Stacy, but she was there. She was in my bed. I, I figured she must have. It's okay. Oh my God, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I, I, I bought it. I didn't even think about who else she could have slept with. I just, that she said that the baby was mine, and she. And she was. It's a lot to take in, I know. You have no idea the things that I did. Because this was my baby, you have no idea what it cost me. Apparently, Mitch and Roxy's baby died, and Allison was too afraid to tell Mitch that, so she just found another one. You mean she stole a baby? Wouldn't be the first time. Allison said that it was an abandoned baby who had just showed up at the hospital. And that was you? Apparently so. Allison just gave me to Roxy and said, here's your baby back. Roxy didn't know the difference. Come on. Well, she kind of suspected it, it somewhere in the back of her mind. But we all know how hard that is to find. Okay, Rex, do you honestly believe any of this? It's, it's all Allison Perkins' word. She's a psycho. Yeah, we'll get a test. But? I already know it. Feels true. I'm so sorry, Balsam. And, and Roxy doesn't have any idea who your parents are. No clue. Hey, look. Um, she's not going anywhere, right? I'm I'm still in Landview, and you know we can work something out. Like you can see her sometimes. Hey, okay. Skyler. Cole? I, I called Langston. Yeah, uh, her phone was just sitting here. I saw your name. Well, is Langston there with you? Yeah. We're at the What Else You Use Cafe. All right, I'm on my way. Ford and Hannah went out a couple of times, but it was nothing serious, and he ended it the moment we got together. And you believed that? Yeah. She showed up at his office. I heard that. She's, like, stalking him. It's kind of sad. That's sad? Like... You lied to your boyfriend to sneak out with a sleeve. You, you don't understand, okay? Then I can't be a part of this. Langston's at the Buenos Dias with Cole. Oh, 
Thank God. Yeah, so don't worry, and I'm sorry for freaking you out like that. No, I, I'm sorry. I would... Uh, Marco! Would you mind if I asked you a personal question? Uh, would that matter? Are you and Langston having problems? You still here? Sure. Where else would I be? Well, yeah. You know, it's it's different now if you know, we move forward with this. No, Blair, I get it. And I can handle your aunt. Good. Um, how about kids? Yours. Mine with Todd. You know, they're they're my heart. And they are my soul. I mean, no star and hope don't live here. I mean, I still worry about them, and nothing can stop that. And, well, Jack, he is definitely a, a piece of work. Sam, he's just still so little, and they all, they all need me, and I need them. I would expect nothing less. Well, actually, the point I'm trying to make here, Elijah, is that I come with a lot of baggage. Can you deal with that? Including my crazy ex-husband? I'm sorry your mom's dead, but coming here only made it worse for you. Nothing could make it worse. Yeah, this didn't help either, did it? Well, I don't know. Did you get anything useful from talking to Mitch? No, you didn't. It's gonna be worse with Allison, if you can even get to her. We got in to see Mitch. Because I have a guard on the payroll. Look, I mean, once, uh, you know, Allison is in custody, she can have a visitor, or we can use our press access. No, bribing them would be easier. Why are you here, if you are gonna keep getting in my way? Getting in your way? I'm trying to help you. It's in your mom's history. Nothing you find out here is going to change that. Just let it go. Todd, if someone you loved was murdered, would you let it go? <laughs>